Take it away, take it away, feeling too good to me Chilling all day, all in your space is where I wanna be still working on the list from yesterday um when i got tired i allowed myself to be tired and do nothing so now here i am and i don't even know if i went to sleep honestly i think i might have went to sleep for like some hours but woke up like at four i've been up since then i did the chair so far i'm sitting in the chair i did the chair that i'll be sitting in when i do hair it's so comfortable and i love it i should have been and got this chair i'm such a procrastinator it took for me to move to get another chair Anyway, I gotta use it so bad. But I just wanna show you the progress. This thing is taking some time, honey. Your literally took like 10 minutes, but this is taking some time. But I like it. It's so many parts to it and it's so sturdy that I'm actually going to purchase more. I'm gonna do another one for hair. This one is specifically for my hair supplies. So I'm gonna do another one for hair, but I might not need another one for hair. Cause it has four drawers and I did downsize a lot. Hold on. I'm not gonna lie, I'm irritated. Cause this shit together wrong, like. They clearly told me to put these things on the outside. And now I'm putting together the drawers. That's the ashes from the incense from over there. But now I'm putting the drawers together and that clearly need to be on the inside. But why would this paper say that? Like the picture wasn't clear that I had to have those on the inside and I'm about to cry because clearly Clearly on this diagram, I see it, but it still don't make sense to me. I'm just very irritated because I don't even know where to begin to take this apart. It's so irritating. I want to cry. <sighs> this took me so long. So pretty much I want to take everything apart that I just did. I'm so irritated. God. Because if it was clear, I wouldn't have never did it that way. And that's probably why you should go over the, the whole directions before you start putting something together. This just made me so mad, like, for real. I'm past that page. It just made me so mad. Can you tell I'm about to cry? Because I didn't want to do this no way, like. I literally got to take these two bottom poles off. These two bottom, this one and this one off. Take this little X thing off. Take this off. That's too. Okay, I'm about to time myself and see how long it takes to redo that part. I'm just so irritated. Like, why didn't it tell me? I'm not faking, I'm definitely finna cry because I'm just so I'm not gonna lie. That was a lot and that was irritating. <sighs> and I cracked the freaking wood trying to redo it. Ugh. I'm irritated and I feel like this one is stripped this side. So it's not even tight enough. Let me just try it again. This little thing keeps falling. And I'm getting high there. I must not be on 
my son love to turn that ear down up and down i'm gonna go and turn the ear back and i got like this little final step to do <laughs> thing I'm gonna do is go get the hanger. I don't even know if I was recording at all. But I got this little list I need to take care of. And then I'm gonna just Uber it. Then I guess we're gonna hit the movies. I'm a, I guess I'm gonna do the car wash movies. He wanted to go to the movies yesterday. Last night I was tired after my client. He know I don't like to do nothing after my client. I don't know what movie out even. So I need to look at the movies. See what what they're playing at what time. I need to get a couple of these things. What does it say? It said do. I kind of need to get stopped at a light. Okay, I guess what I'm gonna do is before I start over, I'm gonna do my little list from yesterday, and then I'm gonna rewrite the list and see what else needs to be done today i am a list girl i love a good list so the first stop i'm about to make is i'm gonna make the first stop that's on the way which is um racetrack i'm just stopping to get some ice pretty much to eat um <laughs> and i might not even get the chick-fil-a because i might just cook i'm not opposed to cooking so i'm stopping at racetrack first But this would be a perfect day to stay at home with my son and I ain't gonna lie. Because of all the things I do a lot of, I do a lot of running around. Let's see, I need to, see this race track be crazy. I'm gonna lay my hand in. Like boy. Okay, three things. One, it smells like sewage by the gas station and I'm not coming to that gas station again. Gas station smell like that. It, it tends to smell like that every time and I'm not. It stinks. Second, I got my ice. I got two small cups. Sis gave it to me for the free ski. I know some people make me pay for it depending on where I'm at and who it is. Mainly females make me pay for it, which I don't know if that's related to anything, but she gave it to me for the free. Oh shit, I passed my turn, but it's a, I can make this other turn. And the last thing is, um, this dude was behind me, and when I went to flip my hair, he got hit almost. Why are you so close? <coughs> Why are you so close? COVID is still a thing. Germs are still a thing. But yeah, y'all, something got me in a chokehold. And I'm about to show y'all. It's embarrassing. I can't go nowhere without getting some. But let's see if they have it or not. But I'm at Dollar General. Mm -hmm. Okay, I spent 36 without getting much of nothing. That was crazy. Crazy. 
kind of want to show y'all what I got, but I don't. Because I'm kind of like, it the person it. But I did get my mom some goalies. She said she's having a hard time sleeping. So, I got her these. I was going to give me the ACV ones. But they um, was expired. This is what I got her. So, I guess I could kind of show y'all what I got. Um, I got this lighter. Needed a lighter. Got these chips in my son. Air freshener. This is like a limited edition one. Um, they're now two something instead of 99 cents. I got this charcoal foot thing. And I'm excited about this one. I didn't even see how much it rung up, but I'm going to do this with my self care tonight. My mama just irritated me just now. I told her I got her some vitamins so she could relax when she get home. She told me she got vitamins. Girl, bye. Take my vitamins. So I got two air fresheners. I got this thing, which is exotic tropical blossom. I got me and my son one of these. So there's two. I got me a little dirty one. Got me some. Um, got a teammate. I love to have teammates on my bed because I be digging for juice. No, my nose be stuffy. Got these. These got me in a chokehold. So let me just write down what I need at the next stuff. Because I'm not trying to be spending 30, 30, 30 at every store I go to. Um, let me find my little list. I don't want to find my shoe got some vitamins. Girl, if you don't take my vitamins, can't wait. She begged me. Right now, I'm the parent. <laughs> okay, so I need some attention. Basically, before I go to the next store, I'm just writing a list, like cutting the list down. I'm a list girl. I write lists for everything. I kind of actually like that Kroger. <laughs>
but it's a bad accident. <laughs> I don't know, I'm gonna take a detour, honestly. So, um, the place I was gonna Uber at, like the common area, is a bad accident. So, I'm just trying to find somewhere to start at. And, um, <laughs> man, I had a bad anxiety attack just a while ago. I walked outside and didn't see the car, and I just had a bad anxiety attack. My son went and moved the car for me because I couldn't find the car. Like, my son be saving my life sometimes. He was like, come down, calm downstairs or whatever. He texts me. And I was like, just come up because I'm having a bad anxiety attack for some reason. I just thought the car was stolen. <laughs> and I didn't see it. I kept hitting the thing and I didn't see it. Because my son did park the car somewhere else because he was practicing backing in, which he sent me a picture of where he parked it at because... Um, when, he, when he backed it in, he wanted to show me that he did good, and he said it was the first try, and he did very well. <clears throat> Here's the picture. So then, I, I didn't see the car, and I got scared. Look how these little houses they're fixing up look so good. I cannot wait to buy a house in two, two to three years. That's my goal, y'all. I got a lot of goals, and I'm just anxious to achieve them. Um, <laughs> I got a lot of goals and I know if I just be patient I'm gonna achieve them but anyway um so yeah I'm just gonna Uber I need to get some ice because I need to feel like I need to shoe on something get some ice and um there's a police right here yeah they definitely trying to block the road off from you they probably gonna make me turn around I took a detour I'm actually out in the belt I'm gonna save my Dunkin drink for tomorrow I am kind of hungry. I went home. Did I eat lunch today? Well, we ate that chicken sandwich. Then later I ate some chips. I ate some sour worms. Ate junk. Ew. I want some ice so bad. I can stop somewhere through a drive through and get some ice if I wanted to without getting out. I want to go to my mama's house and chill, but I got to be responsible and work. Because, baby, this is my job, too. So I'm gonna hop off here. So yeah, I'm about to turn it on. My car is like be behind you for a long time. It don't make sense to me. Cause how you go from all the way over there and you still following me? I don't like that. And that's when I be randomly pulling over. Like, so I'm finna randomly turn in this neighborhood so I can get away from the car. I don't like it. But I'm going to start planning my vlogs out. Mm. <clears throat> I need to. Is this jacket I want to buy? I need to find a brown crop top jacket. Crop jacket. And yeah, a brown tank. That's my next purchase. I need. I'm scared to put my pinky in my eye because it has some, it has a hot cheeto. Yeah, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to turn down here. And I'm going to see if they turn. More than likely they're not going to turn, but it's my paranoia. <laughs> I'm paranoid right now. I just don't like when people be following me. Yeah, you feel me? So I gotta act like I'm going in this neighborhood and I'm really not. They kept straight. Now I can turn around, my boy. I'm not paranoid, but it's just like... As a woman, you do have to be cautious. People crazy. I'm not gonna lie, y'all. I'm so appreciative of life. Like, God put me in some situations and took me out of some situations. And even though they not all panning, I mean, I ain't gonna say not all panning out. Even though they not all exactly where I want them to be at the moment, they are in the direction. My gratitude. Um, tonight I need to write in my gratitude journal and I just need to write for like 10, 20 minutes like what I'm grateful for. Like those things, those exercises are um, pr productive and beneficial. That's not the word I was looking for. But um, they work. Yeah, I'm so excited. Like because I'm looking at these new houses and I know in two or three years I'm about to be 35, right? So, by the time I'm 38, 37, 38, I'm going to buy me a house. And that's a lot for me. Like, I don't like to put no emphasis on me doing it alone, being a single mom. But that's a lot for me to be able to buy my own house. And I'm this close to doing it. I'm two years away. Two and a half, three years away. I'm so grateful, God. Thank you, Most High. Like, I'm 
I'm seriously grateful. I don't really talk about spirituality, God, religion, or anything like that, mostly because everybody believes I'm different. And um, I just don't feel like I should have to explain my spirituality, my, my beliefs, my beliefs are my beliefs. And your beliefs are your beliefs. And I respect everybody's beliefs or whatever. Every religion is different and the same. <laughs> but anyway. So yeah, let me cut on my little Uber thing. But I'm just so grateful. I'm so thankful. Like, I'm just so thankful. I, I, I'm, uh, I'm thinking and talking at the same time. But it's like a lot that I want to do for my son in the next couple of years to prepare him for adulthood but I also want to give him experiences in the next two years and I'm just grateful that I see that coming to flourishing and y'all will see it in the vlogs too um, my vlogs are going to change it's not going to be just me in the car like you might get some chatty vlogs but it'll be us living our lives or whatever traveling and doing so and so you probably won't see my son's face but you'll see his body or you'll hear his voice or whatever but becoming more comfortable with myself like I am comfortable but in actuality I might have some discomfort with myself and I only say that because like I always wear the same thing and um I don't even explore the clothes in my closet that I have so I'm like I want to be completely comfortable with, with whoever I am oh my god that was a goat a dead goat anyway y'all we'll talk about that another time